this project has an exceptional impact in that uh, OSU Cascades is going to deliver a mass timber prototype that's net zero uh, as part of their campus expansion. This project in particular is going to demonstrate how mass timber can be incorporated into future academic buildings and really allow universities to invest in a cost-effective solution that has uh, sustainable practices associated with it. So Mass Timber, uh, we were very successful with a project we did out in Hillsboro uh, called First Tech Federal Credit Union that really was a breakthrough for the industry as a whole for Mass Timber. It really showed us how we could start to build smarter with a consideration for more sustainable products. And we've continued to progress and develop that, having completed 10 buildings now, having six in construction and over 20 in pre-design. When OSU first contemplated the project, they thought it could be 50,000 square feet of program area, or we could focus on net zero, or we could focus on mass timber. What we were able to do here is deliver the 50,000 square feet of space, give it to them with a net zero solution, as well as delivering on the mass timber. And so it was and and rather than or or. The mass timber is, uh, is a big part of the carbon story that people are starting to really focus on. For instance, structural steel takes a lot of energy to melt the ore and create steel. Uh, whereas um, trees, I mean, the trees it would take to replace what we're putting into the structure, it would take Oregon Forest about three minutes uh, to regrow that wood. The reforestation strategies, the approach to thinning forests, forestry practices that are being studied by Sustainable Northwest is exciting to also share that aspect of it because we're making the forests uh, respond and, and be healthier and it's a, it's a better way to approach harvesting lumber. Oregon State University has done an amazing job with their project manager, uh, Jared, and he's uh, led the team and kind of inspired everybody to, to take it to a new level where we're all looking to succeed together to deliver something more to the industry to then demonstrate a path forward. The reality is that people, when they're inside of one of these structures, when they're done, they have an amazing reaction to the wood. They come out of it and they just have a smile on their face and they're just like, man, I feel so much more at ease and I'm like, I feel better about the day because of what, you know, where I was. What an amazing workplace. These buildings are about the people inside and creating environments that, uh, that, uh, that they respond to. You know, think about this for an academic building. Students are going to want to be in this building taking these classes. Professors are going to want to be in this building. Uh, teaching students the, the light that comes in through the windows, how that's laid out, the central space. They're going to be amazing spaces that are going to impact people for generations to come.